All right, here we go. We've got a brand new client. She's a, I told her she's a Karen mix, but she came in as a Yorkie mix. You don't like that? It's okay. It's okay. Come here. It's okay. Come here. Let me see if I can, can I, can I do the pads here? Let me see. Let me see. Let's do the pads. Yeah, it's okay. Checking because it's pulled so fast. Checking for mats or something in there. You're okay. Can I see here? The color is so dark. No, 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 no. Okay, just to doing the pads with the forty on my and his five speed which I love. I'm going to do get my 10 blade. We're going to come back and we're going to do it. So the mom wants half off and she's not picky of how we do it. So it's pretty, it's a lot of hair. I think she's a Karen mix. She was told she was a Yorkie mix for so long, but just from what I'm seeing, I'm thinking a uh, Karen mix. I could be wrong though. We don't know a mixed dog. You don't know the bloodline and nothing is ever exact. Like, we all have blood in, bloodline in, in our history, and it's not exactly one thing. So, I know some of you guys are really picky about your breeds, and uh, this one came in as a rescue, didn't you? Yes, you did. Okay, so I'm actually going to come down with my one guard and see if that's going to be good enough for what I call about half off the coat. And I like to be pretty specific when they are like, I want a haircut, and then I want to know half off more than half off you know what i'm saying like get specifics you can start down here first so you can kind of see does that take about half off and she had a flea uh, breakout so all this hair you know was missing right here on the side um so she said i would love that kind of more blended in So this may or may not work. I gotta see. I need to get my brush. I started from the back so that I could do a spot check and make sure this is gonna work. If it's not, then it's not. It, I can kind of hide that back here. Then I would be able to hide the neck. Okay, that's why I kind of started at the back to see is this what the length I want to go with. And I think it is. Uh, there's gonna be a little shorter right here where that hair loss was due to the fleas. Yeah, and she knew that. Oh, 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 See how dangerous that is when that loop is even like slightly loose. It's crazy, man. Okay, well, I can't trust you. Okay, it's tight now. Just something could make a dog just panic. Same thing. Same reason why they can just something could just make that dog want to bite. You just never know what it is. A word, a touch, a sound, anything. We're just squeaky. Uh -uh, no, stop, stop, stop. That panic, does that make you panic? It's okay. You're freaking me out when you do that. You're freaking me out, girl. She seems to be just worried. Definitely making me worry though. You're okay. You're okay. You're okay. I know it. It's so weird. This little thing, all this clipper movement and stuff. Okay, you're okay. Can okay, you look up? Yeah, you safe. Don't even look at the clippers. Yeah. Okay. Okay, she doesn't like the clipper sound, which is fine. She's, I don't trust her with this broom loop getting too loose. So let me come this forward here. 
She hasn't gone to the bath yet, so this is just the rough end, okay? I'm gonna comb all that forward. Can you guys even see what I'm doing here? Barely, it's such a dark pet, so. Hopefully you can see what I'm doing with the face a little bit. I'm gonna leave the wispies here. Okay, I'm gonna come in with the floor guard. So it's just a little tighter and I can go a little, just one, you know, like this. Just I don't have to keep coming back and forth. It's just a little tighter though. Tighter as in uh, takes off more hair than the one that I was using, the beige one. I don't want to trust her too much without the groom loop being tight. And just real lightly down because that way it doesn't look like I used a four. Okay. Go so this way. Kind of grab, not just real, real lightly here. Grab some of those. Watch your ear flaps. I kind of love all this stuff right here. Okay. Come down there. I'm going to leave it kind of straggly, sloppy. I'm going to do a little bit of four on the legs here. Okay, okay. Let me make sure you're tight here. I can't have you jumping around. So I know some of you guys are always worried about that groom loop. That's why. Did you see how fast she got out of it? She could have potentially just jumped off the table. Very, very um, big safety loop there. Some dogs you just cannot trust without that groom loop being completely tight. Just because they jump doesn't mean they land on their fours. You see? No, don't get mad. I don't know what you're thinking, but don't get mad at me. No. You're all right. Very nervous, you know, but very sweet. Okay, turn this way. No, look forward. Pour down the legs here. A little bit of reverse here. This is just going to save me hand scissor time. Kind of the same thing. Pour down through the tummy. Pour sanitary. Kind of come back and clean up with your tin later. Man, she does not like certain things done up here. Smell this. You are focused on something else? Hi. Hi. You're okay. Let me see. Can I see? You kind of want them to give you the arm, you know what I mean? You don't want them to kind of jerk it unless you have to. In your, in your, she's really touchy. Okay. I'm about to just let you go to the bath. I am going to change out my tent. And do sanitary real fast. I should come in and turn it Yeah, no, we're not going to do that. All right, she doesn't like the clippers around her face or her front two feet. So I need to I'm going to come in with my bubble tip. It's okay. Don't her ears. Watch her ears. Just kind of, I don't want to take off any of this stuff. It's just kind of like a breed. No, no, you're okay. A breed thing, I think. I know, I know, I don't know why. I don't know why. Yeah, I'm not sure why. No, I don't know why I gotta do this. I'm gonna let, um, we'll get some of this eye boogers out. No, no, you're good, you're good, you're good. I'm gonna brush all this up in my way, okay? See, I just did that, it's all up in her eyeballs, right? Okay, 
And I really don't want to take any of that out like that, but I'm going to chisel away a little bit with my thinning shears because she's doing this fast reaction, um, which is dangerous. So we've got this thinning shear that's going to help us. Okay, here we go. That way I can kind of do this smoothing out and just really, oh, I don't really use these very often, but I do need them. I know, I know. I'm just going to thin out a tiny bit, a crack into that eye area, that's all. No, don't do that. Don't do that. Okay, okay. I'm going to pet her face. Uh, no, no, you're okay. I'm holding the chin hair here. It's very important. She could already have hurt herself. No, don't do that. Don't do that. Let me see. Let me see. Let me see. You're okay. Man, she's scary. Okay, stop. You're going to scare me. No, no. No. No, no, nice and easy, good job. We're gonna take it easy. This would be a very, very prime, prime example of me. I'm gonna show mom this video later and I want her to really get one of these tools, okay? Man, there's bite marks on this one. She's gonna hold her and I want her to do this with it. For like 30, oh, not 30, three to five minutes a day, right? It's just getting her used to it, that's all. Because we want to get those scissors in here without uh, quick movement. That could definitely be painful. So we sell these, they're on our website. We sell them not for the groomer necessarily. Well, yeah, those aggressive dog grooms, you know how I use it, right? But definitely for the pet parent to get their dog ready when they don't like their face or they want to bite the clippers. This is really, really a big tool. So this homework should be an everyday thing to get her used to it. Come, come on, come on. Get her used to this, okay? Real nice and easy. Yeah. Yeah, you're okay. See, you're okay. All right, we're going to go to the bathroom. We'll be back. Thanks for watching. Thank you. 
Steve, man, dang. Okay, so let me get the camera. Okay, here we go. We're going to finish her up here. I'm going to brush it up a little bit. Now, one guard back down again. Tidy it all up. So, I had a lady uh, out of Australia writing me, and a lot of you are in Australia, uh, five or six, uh, not writing me, but that I've ordered, but the lady who ordered some products. Oh my gosh, she uh, has a great story, and I forgot my, I lost my train of thought. Oh my goodness, what am I trying to say here? I totally lost my train of thought. Oh, okay, no. So she does groom dogs, and she said since she's found my channel, she started roughing dogs in, which some of you don't do. You guys just go straight to the tub. She said she's shaved about 30 minutes off of every dog now that she roughs it in. So the blow drying goes so much faster. And I am just so, I was like, yeah, that's awesome, you know, because if she can do more dogs that day, if she wants to, or she can just be moving a little faster just to be ahead of schedule. So she, the rough-ins have really helped some of you guys out there, and I'm really glad you learned that um, on my channel. And I uh, wish you the best in success in your businesses. So thanks for watching. Thanks for subscribing. I really appreciate it. Canada and Australia are some of our biggest sales. We help you guys out there build a lot of orders, and uh, I can't thank you enough. Coming back to my four, if you haven't noticed. And she's really worried about some things, so I am watching everything I'm doing, and I'm going, I am going fast. That's just how I like to groom. Okay, so we're gonna come back and do, due to what's going on with her demeanor, gonna come back and kinda just trim the legs with scissors. If you see something uneven, go ahead and take it. These are my eight and a half shears. All of it. Are you okay? It's a reverse sneeze. It's okay. This is what happens. This is my opinion, and I've been taught by a veterinarian, but this is what I believe is happening. It's like, yeah, she, she forgot to take a breath, you know. Here, in this situation, she just forgot to breathe. Can it happen? Yeah. Some dogs hold their breath when we're trying to do grooming. You're okay. You're okay. And it, just in case, we'll bring this down a little bit, but that's not what it is, because look at all this slack right here. Okay. Okay. You're good. Nothing's happened. See all these. I'm just gonna, instead of doing the guard, which I would prefer to do. She's just real sensitive, you know. Just let her. Um, maybe the next time she'll be more used to me. Just tiny bit off the tail. I'm gonna kind of leave this longer. To 
just kind of bringing it in more like a carrot than anything here. And she's a mixed breed, so you know we're not being too picky or anything like that. We're not trying to make it a carrot, but it's okay. Hold on, hold on. I need you to relax. You're okay. You're okay. Come here. You gotta breathe. Make sure you're breathing. You're okay. You're okay. Are you okay? Hmm? It's okay. Let me see. Good girl. Are you okay? Yeah. Are you okay? Hmm? You gotta be okay, okay? That's a lot of okays, isn't it? You okay? You're okay. Ooh, I just noticed a dew claw, a high one. We gotta make sure we did get that nail trim back there. You're okay. I don't know. Let me help you. Do I need to help you hold your head up? Is that what I need to do? Mm -hmm. I'm help you hold your head up. You gotta make sure you're breathing. Okay. Man, they're still playing that music over there loud. What are they doing? Just don't understand. Okay, let's see here. Hold on here, hold on. Maybe I should talk louder, because I mean, what they do is this. I don't want any copyright issues, because we're not even playing that music. No, 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 stay there. It's affecting our business over here. Let me see here. Okay. Come on now, let me see your foot. Don't get mad at me. Don't get mad at me, come on now. Don't get mad at me. Don't get mad at me. Come on now. Come on here. Okay. Let's see here. Doing great, right? Hold your head up. Make sure you're breathing. Okay, so let's see here. Go around this way, tidying up the feet and everything. check out. I'm going to do my, um, I'm actually going to try the bubble. Okay. Let's try the bubble. She's worried about the swiping situation. So let's see here. The swiping situation on, uh-uh, 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 uh-uh. We're going to come up here, down there. Come on. No, no. Hold the chin. No, no. We're not going to fight. No, I don't want to fight with you. We don't want to fight. Okay. No, no. No, no, I'm going to leave the wispies on the ears. Come over here, do this for me. Okay, let's see your, let's see your face now. Can you guys see all this? Let me see here. Come here, hold on here. It was done, it's dead. Is it? It's still recording though. There. Good, let's see here, good girl. Can I come in here? Yeah. That's a difference, isn't it? Yes, it is. Yeah, that's a good girl. That's a good girl. I'm going to leave all this. I kind of like it. I'm just opening your eyes just a little bit, okay? So we're going to end it there because David said we're, we're dying over here. And hopefully we don't have any issues with the music from next door. And we'll be able to load this. Thanks for watching DD Core with my favorite groomer on YouTube. Oh, the coat's so soft. So if you want some of our shampoos, our conditioners, our My Favorite spray bottle, any of the tools you need, you know I'm mentioning it. Go to our uh, MyFavoriteGroomer.com, our online store. And thank you for your support and watching us. And I um, can't say thank you enough. We'll talk to you later.